So we are going to dinner at the Iguana restaurants. And this is actually previously the home of Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton. It's my birthday and I've been up since 5 a.m. Now I'm gonna wake up Megan. It's my birthday. Oh. Happy birthday. Oh, thanks. Oh. No, no. It's my birthday. <laughs> what are we doing for my birthday? Happy birthday. Thank you. What are we doing? Oh, uh, well, we have to get up. What time is mm -hmm. it? I don't know. I've been up since five. <laughs> the sun's up. I'm up. <laughs> That's not typical. Today it is. All right, well, we have to get up. We have to mm -hmm. put our suits on. What suits? <laughs> Birthday suit. Birthday suit? <laughs> Should I take the shirt off? No, this one's yeah, that, It's not YouTube appropriate. Because we're going to go. What are we going to go do? We're going to go surfing. <laughs> okay. Let's go surfing. Come on. <laughs> Come on. And now that I am more awake, we had some breakfast, we are ready to go find our surfing guide. All right. Vamanos. So we're at Wild Mix, the surf shop. We have to pick up our surfboard and a wetsuit for Megan. I drank probably a gallon of salt water. I am so out of breath. I just got pounded by the waves. I didn't stand. I did body surf pretty epically. I mean, I'll call that a win. <laughs> Let's see if Andrew catches a wave. Walking out. Surfing's my new thing. <laughs> We're buying a surfboard? We're buying a surfboard. I'll watch and film. He's also burning right now. 
been out here for what, a couple hours now, yeah? A few hours? I think so. I was like, I'm not going in until I catch a couple waves, so I'm not graceful yet, but. But he caught him. But I caught him. We're back. We are. We've had an amazing day of surfing. Actually caught some waves. Some of the biggest waves I've ever caught. There you go. It's a good, good uh, surf stance. I body surfed mm -hmm. and got extremely burnt. So yes. I don't, this side it's, of my leg is purple. It's going to be rough. <laughs> it's all right. It was worth it. And now we are going to go get ready and do something really freaking cool. Let's go. You look good. Uh, you look good too. <laughs> we clean up nice. All right, so we are going to dinner at the Iguana Restaurants. And this is actually previously the home of Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton. And it's an amazing love story full of passion and scandal and Ooh. all the right things. I didn't know that. <laughs> And we're on a really bouncy bridge yeah, right now, are. also. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> okay, so it all started in 1962 when Richard Burton came to Puerto Vallarta, which at the time was just a quiet little fishing town. He came here to film the Night of the Iguana, and that's when he met Elizabeth Taylor, and this is where the scandal comes in. Oh. She was in a relationship already. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> okay, to be continued. And the story continues. So she was married to Eddie Fisher and he was married to Sybil Williams, but they just couldn't bear to be mm. apart. Aww. And thus the love story began. Richard Burton bought Casa Kimberly for Elizabeth Taylor and his casita was across the street. They built a bridge in between, which was handy for avoiding the paparazzi and also noted where they would run when they had their spirited arguments. Uh, spirited arguments. They were married and divorced two times, but never stopped being in love with Puerto Vallarta. inside and out and we only got to see the restaurant and the courtyard so I can only imagine the guest suites. Everywhere you turn it is adorned with pictures of the gorgeous Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton. There are movie posters and we've read that the hotel kept so many of their original pieces including inside one of the rooms a pink marble heart-shaped bathtub commissioned by Liz herself pool that they both swam in and of course the famous bridge connecting their two homes. A quick search we did found that the rooms range from about 300 to 600 US dollars a night and I know I'm adding this on to my list next time we come to Puerto Vallarta. Really good. 
everything here is really good. So Elizabeth Taylor's house was a 10 out of 10. Megan said that she would like to move in tomorrow. I'll move in, all my stuff. <laughs> it was perfect. Overall, my birthday was amazing. I had a great day of just relaxing on the beach, surfing, and then such a great way to end it on a beautiful sunset and just a really an iconic hotel and restaurant. I feel like our day really depicted what you can do in Puerto Vallarta as well. Like if you want to keep it super chill, you can keep it super chill. Mm -hmm. And if you want to get real luxe and fancy, you can get real luxe and fancy. Yeah. Personally, we like to do both. That's actually, <laughs> I feel like Puerto Vallarta, like yeah. in a nutshell. You mean so. <laughs> All right. On that, time to call it a day and go pack. I might sleep. Good night. All right.